came outside and there was three deer in the backyard. I chased them away and I got the dogs inside to check if they were injured. And this one's eye was covered with blood and started to bleed. A Penticton man is calling on the city to do something about its urban deer after two of his dogs were attacked in his backyard off Carmi Road. Chuck Myers says he led his two dogs out into the backyard to do their business and heard a commotion shortly after. Three deer, including a buck, were attacking his dogs. The mature canine had a bleeding eye. The deer took off and she was just stunned. She was just like sitting there hurt. So I took her inside and said my heart broke when I saw her eye. Meyer says deer in the area are a constant problem. He's exasperated and would like to see a cull. Like how my yard drops down, I don't think I can put a big enough fence to keep them out. And then they're going to jump over from there or somewhere they're going to get back in here, right? There's not much I can do. Do something because it's not really working for me. I know multiple people that have dogs injured, even killed by these deers and nothing's happening. Like they'll chase people down, so what if someone gets hurt? That's why I bought this house, so I could have a dog and have a safe place for it to go to the bathroom, do whatever it wants, but they can't do that. Myers credits Dr. Oz at the Rose Valley Medical Clinic for saving his dog's life after he came in after hours for the call. Penticton City Council hasn't shown much appetite to tackle the problem. Councillors were silent last time a request for a call came before them late last year from a mobile home park on the south end of the city. For Castanet in Penticton, I'm Colin Dacre.